Why this? He hold on there. Why are you berating me like that? He how many times have I run into a ditch? He how many times have I crushed your foot? He how many times have I ever just laid down in the road? He how many times? Not a one. <laughs> the donkey spoke, Balaam was so bug I and bum-fuzzled, he finally saw the angel. Who said? Hello. Balaam, you can go back home to Moab now, but you better say only what the Lord tells you to. You hear? <laughs> and when Balaam met up with big bad Balak, God put words of praise in his mouth. Praising the Israelites for not living like the wicked Moabites. How beautiful are your tents, O Jacob, your dwelling places, O Israel! <laughs> Whoa. Let me get... Whoa, let me get this straight. God spoke through a donkey, an angel, and then through Balaam? That's right. All throughout the Bible, God spoke in all kind of ways. And he still speaks to us, if we just listen. Listen closely. Listen closely. Can you hear it in the breeze, in the rustle of the trees, what's he saying? In a way. Oh.